Button has been pushed. I approve of these actions. We are live, I ahoy, folks. Ahoy. That's all right. Welcome to the Thursday gaming stream. Wait a minute, I brought my paintbrushes. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm literally sitting there painting Dark Angels. What the fuck's going on? What's going on here? Dark. I know, I know, I, I know. Sweet Christmas, Zug. Yes, I know. Do you want me to end the stream and start again? <laughs> Ahoy, Frost. Ahoy. Right, I'll be... <laughs> just... uh, right, I'm slowing the game. I've got to take my... I've got to take my... Um, I get all sexy for a second. I've just got to take my... Um, You've got to get all sexy off. for a second. Uh, one second, I'm going to miss something. All right. Yeah, welcome to... Uh... Thursday night, Dark Tide. If you're new here on the channel, you know, feel free to chip in, ask questions, do it if you want. And uh, we will avail to answer anything you have to ask. Do what? Just say, you know, if new people are on the channel, feel free to ask questions. We will do all we can to answer. And if you're not, you know, like, subscribe, hit the little bell for notifications. There's lots of things to come. There's lots of things to come. Well, there'll be more builds and stuff as the weeks go on. Alright. Fair enough. Um, the Emperor doth decree that Dark Tide must be played this week. I did suggest that instead of actually playing Dark Tide, he paint Dark Tide models and made some conversions of Dark Tide models and I've painted really, them. I have many the bits that? to do it. Why, why, have you, why are you so disappointing every time you disappoint? Well, you know... That's just who I am. So, yes. who are you choosing to play to start off with? Oh, green. Oh, oh green. green. I right. like the old green. The old green is fun, and it's and the builds are very, very simple. I like it. It's go this way if you want ranged. Go this way if you want melee. Go the other way if you're not sure. I'm playing gun, gun green, gun, gun you No, know, I was like, like. Ogre with a shotgun last time. I was yeah. really enjoying that. Man, you really need to try it out with a ammunition. Honestly, man, try it with a heavy stubber. It's very, very heavy fun. Stubber. Have you? Man, heavy stubber is really fun to play with. Hoi Django. Hoi, hoi Django. Well, the the thing about it is, um, the thumbnail does say Zug paints, does it? It shouldn't do. He's trying to wind us up. Doesn't. <laughs> Bad frost. Um, no um, scaring Zug. Um, what is it? Uh, does having ads give us more views? Um, I think we're just kind of hitting the the wave of new. Dark tidiness. Yeah, that's what I think. I've been on it like a car bonnet, mate. Bad frost. Very bad frost. <laughs> that's it. That's it. On. You've done it now, Frost. These Terminators—they're getting stripped again. I hope you're happy. Right, I'm ready anyway, man. Whatever. You in the game? All right. Yeah. Oh, I just couldn't see. Ah, oh, there you are. Invite to strike team. Uh, yeah, and yeah, I think. Oh, uh, yeah. The, anyway, just to talk about the nature of what's going on. Yeah, I think. I think one, we hit the wave with Dark Tide, so we've got hit the wave with Dark Tide. So it's kind of like nicely congealed with Dark Tide. Um, us, us getting over. So, and, and we might be being promoted more, but unfortunately, we don't know at the moment. Because we literally had one day of metrics before Zug and then conveniently went and made a bunch of videos about Dark Tide. And it, it screwed everything up by getting us loads of views and subscribers, so Yeah. I am an awful person. <laughs> so um yeah, everything's gone a bit mad. So but hey, 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 you know. It's all good. It's all good. 
Well, when we when we find out more information about what's going on about, we'll let you know because it's kind of interesting to sort of like yeah. Stripping the mastery paint and green lol. We'll start with a, a normal match first, just to like warm ourselves up, stretch out a bit, and then we'll start doing some harder stuff. Mm. Right, Drink so I'm using. Tonight. I'm tired. Oh, I'm drinking tea. Because I am also tired. Oh, we've got an Ogryn. We've got two Ogryns. We've got, okay. I've got a better hair cover than that Ogryn. Yeah. I'm, go I'm using the telekinetic shield for this one. I'm being a helpful psyker. I like you. Yeah, some crazy days. Crazy days. Join us on our journey. And I haven't even had to re to resort to going. What's up, guys? <laughs> what? Just, uh, just one of the streamers does that, and it irritates me. I'm a psycho. I've got a big staff. I'm a psycho. Do 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 do. Nope, not yet, Frost. So, this build is more of a helpful build. <laughs> oh, the crusher hit me in my squishy parts. Why would he do that? Ahoy, wandering. Ahoy, wandering. Oh no, bad men. Okay. Where have you gone? I'm standing behind you. Oh no, that's not you, that's the other one. There you all look the same. Break season. Have a shield. Fancy racism and you're not allowed to be fancy racist. I saw somebody make a uh, a really weird video the other day. It was um, is salts by a racist? Uh, yes, yes he is. <laughs> yeah, he totally is. Yeah, he's a witch it's hunter in the empire. A, part of the zealoty part. <laughs> Don't you care? Like, uh, medicine, fill me with your goodness. I mean, sniper. I Ray burst. Cross the bridge. Yeah, it's like Saltzbury is literally a massive bigot. That's what makes yeah. him like a witch hunter. The. Uh, Unhand me, you brute.
yeah, the Surge Staff, it may not be able to stun people anymore, but it does do horrifically large damage. Like, it's two-shotting crushes and bulwarks and things. So don't ride it off, folks. The what stuff? Uh, the Emperor Palpatine Staff, you know, the lightning one. Okay. What did I say for us? What have I come quartered this time? Yeah, I mean, that's... I don't agree with racism in the real world. It's stupid and unfounded and just very silly, but the 40k universe is pretty much based on bigotry, racism, and fear of it, the outsider. It's just how it works. And so's, uh, so's um, what's it, fantasy? Yeah, like, the dwarves hate the elves, the elves hate everyone. So, in the context is a fantasy environment, it adds flavour to the world. Yeah. Wouldn't do if we all got along. Oh no, I didn't say anything like that. He was The monster was just touching me in my squishy parts. Like my squishy face. Oh, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be talking about that for us. Do, do, do. Honestly, I actually have no recollection of saying anything just now, and I'm very confused. Oh, it still knocks things over, though. Just not as much as it did. They am helpful in giving everyone a lovely turtle shield. Oh, yeah, so helpful. Be the turtle. Feel the turtle. Be one with the turtle. What do I want? I want lettuce. Oh, oh. Ow. Release your lettuce to me. Let me reload my gun. Uh, okay. Bees. There are bees everywhere. I I think the community went a little bit overboard when they were screaming about the surge staff being broken. In what way broken? It it doesn't just it automatically stun lock everything continuously. But instead of doing that. It does do lots and lots and lots of damage. Which it didn't do before. Although I do think they've slightly reduced the jumping of the lightning too much by one or two. Absolute son of a gun. Mm -hmm. I'm just I'm just thinking up other ways we can scream profanity without actually screaming profanity. Oh yeah man, it's the most challenging thing in the world. I've actually been going with, with wanderings profanity and just go now beans. Or oh marmalade. Yeah, the staff still happily stuns one target, so... Sorry, Chango, we'll, we'll look at your comment shortly. I'm just incredibly confused. 
Oh, I've not gone to like WhatsApp chat. Oh, I'm not on live chat either, I'm on top chat. There we go. Aha! Uh -huh. The woman who told you should start a dancing workshop turned up and did she dance? Sir, did she dance? Did she dance with you? Did she dance Jane, like nobody then? else was in the room? Just, just dance in general, I guess. Push the bubbly bop a little bit. I'm being helpful. I'm not so bad at bibbity bopping. I'm not quite sure what I'm looking for on the map, on the bibbity bop screen. Uh, corpses. This is corpses. You're not supposed to be this shit into this sniper. Oh. Bottoms. I overloaded myself. them almost continuously mm -hmm. I can drop them almost continuously yeah, right. There's some sort of special talent you have for that yep my lovely special psycho talent of happy happy bubbles Oh, Jago. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Yeah, the search stuff is just absolutely lethal. And this is the defensive build I've gone with. This isn't like the the tricked out damage you build. You're all about the bubbles today. Yep. Bubble of goodness. Oh yeah. Word of mouth will really help. Mosey on. Where is he? I hit 
hear a bomber, but I don't see a bomber. Ah, he's over there. Got him. It's like Ogre with a shotgun. Better than a hobo with a shotgun. Absolutely. A little bit of chopping. Very loud. We're doing all right, aren't we? Yeah. I think that's a good idea, Django. And don't forget to guilt people into doing it. Yeah. The only reason Zug didn't turn up is you want to tell him your address. It's true. So he can visit you in the future. I know he's in Berlin now, though. I, mean, I have narrowed fairly, you down to a city. It's fairly... That's like saying, you know, you live in the UK. I can put, like, a little uh, thing down, can I? Here, look. Oh, yeah, me too. Got us even carrying one. So have you got any new builds in mind then, Zug? Um, probably one that means I stop exploding. Because I've done that twice now, it's a bit embarrassing. Should probably do that. The embarrassment is palpable. But you've also got to remember, Frost, my brain doesn't work that quickly. I didn't know who's in Berlin. <laughs> my defense is I wasn't probably here when he said it. I would yeah, remember he's, that. He said it on Tuesday. Okay, I wasn't paying any attention. It's more like it. I can't pay attention all the time. Just doing the working end and thinking that where's a man out? Have some big old ogre grenades. Yeah. It's 
go. So yeah, search stuff does do lots and lots and lots of lovely damage. Probably close that door. There you go. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. I saw the Sword Fighting Guild YouTube channel thing. I saw that. Oh, we still can't skip this. Oh, it's not that bad. I don't want to watch it. It gives time, me the time to type GG. I'm very good at typing GG. It's one of my hobbies. You are. I'm proud of you. Thank you. I was struggling to find the actual key then. Yeah. So yeah, I was just quickly chatting about the, the channel quickly. Um, yeah. I was going to say it's like, yeah, we don't really know what's going on with it at the moment, do we? Not it's good lot, though. We don't understand stats yet. It's no. I mean, it's good. That stuff's good. That everyone's joining and liking and subscribing and all that shit. Oh well, whatever. We're in the video. Twenty-six. It's not like we're thirteen seconds into the video, is it? Um, uh, uh, yeah, but we don't understand metrics yet. There you go. We still don't understand metrics. Or mathematics. Or whether we're being, or whether we're being promoted more because of the whole algorithm. What stubble do you think I should get there? Uh, the Achilles one's pretty good, so it's the lightest one, but it has loads and loads of ammo. Uh... Oh yeah, there is a membership for 99 of your American pennies. You can become a member. No, 99. No, no, it's a 99 um, theme park. Theme park coins. 99 tuppence. 99. Nine. What is it called? Luft balloons. Luft balloons. No, oh, no, it's the, Luft balloons. There's the Achilles, which is the, the light version, the Gorgonon, which is the heavy version, and the Korok, which is the standard middle variant. Okay. I can't do any of those. Have we wait 44 seconds, though. We can wait 44 seconds? Yeah. No, oh, that's sad. The next no, step all... is to sell advertising on this channel. Yep. They'll promote your LARP group yep. or your if... dancing group, Django. For 10 Deutschmarks. Not even that. Right, let's see if I get a better. I could just try and buy a, a go 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 gun. Gun. What is it? Is that the one? That's the heavy one. That's oh, good, and so is the Achilles. Hold on, modifiers. So with modifiers, it's got a rating of three seven nine. It's pretty good. Is that good or bad? What colour is it? Grey. Grey, and it's a base of 379. Yeah, buy it. Upgrade it, see what happens. All I say is 379. Yeah, there's buy two, it. There's a rating, and then there's a, like another rating underneath it. But if it's a grey weapon, that means there's no modifiers on it. Yeah. 379 is almost as high as you can get. There's only one level higher, which is 380. Okay. So we're going to try out... I don't even know what that was. That was a... Oh, I'll try upgrading or whatever. It was some sort of stubber. I don't know. I'm not very good. Yeah, we're going with the trauma staff this time. Cause some trauma. I got a Gorgon on. Yeah, that's the heavy one. And it's very, very good. And you can chew through lots of things with it. I'll consecrate that bad boy then. Yeah, just pump it up as high as you can, and then we can fiddle with it later. I 
Oh yeah, Jango, don't get disheartened, dude. Just, you know, keep plugging away. Try the yeah. Okay, let me know when you're ready to do another one. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, I'm ready. Um, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, man. Keep at it. These things um take time. All things take time. I suppose it's quite lucky that, like, quite lucky that you've actually got a LARP group nearby. Yeah. Sort of like handy resource for selling, like, leather goods and dance lessons. <laughs> it's what you want. It's perfect. We believe in you, Django. A fascinating aroma. Very lived in. Or possibly smothered by. Wait till it doesn't have to get pumped through here. Hopefully you'll be gone by then. Do not run out of place. That's a You're spirit, Django. Get the dance. You have a lot to dance. You will learn, and you will enjoy it. I'm an agent of death, but don't call me Shirley. Oh. Oh god, he's using bloody smoke grenades. Kill the sniper. Some questionable decisions were made in this up construction. Nice small cow. Just where you want to put down room. So this build is the classic psycho sort of original build. But we 90% more fire. Burst. It always makes me laugh.
Everyone likes toast. Yeah. I was just commenting on the chat. Help that zealot and just run in and then kind of aggro everything. We probably um, push the button. Yep. I'm holding onto the bed pack. How are you liking the uh, stubber? Yeah, man, it's pretty cool. It's got like a nice jug, 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 jug to it. I think that's a technical. Yep. Or rat -a tat tat is the scientific uh, name for it. Let's go already. So to any uh, veterans watching, the smoke grenade is not useful. Please don't use it. No? Why no. Because not only does it blind them, it blinds us. Maybe we want to be blind. Oh, yeah, man. Yeah. They just sort of beep around the place for ages while you're trying to find them. And I might, you know, you might be thinking, so you beautiful hero of a man, why are you using a purge staff on a crusher? It's because the, the purge staff will trigger brain burst. So I can set everything on fire, while also triggering the auto brain burst, which will kill the crusher. I wasn't thinking that, but I mean, cheers, man. I was thinking more for our... our 
valid views. Knowledgeable viewers. Looks like a glowing orange. Maybe he likes to glow orange. It is spooky season after all. Genuine. Set everything on fire. Uh, yeah, it is. It's a selected talent, so whatever staff you're using will trigger it. But the purge staff. It's just quite funny using AOE abilities and then just seeing Brain Burst go off in the middle and take out an elite. Uh, this build is basically all fire all the time. Something monstrous comes this way. That was much shooting. Went down pretty easy. Hang on. I just emptied like many bullets into him. Somebody please shoot that sniper. And everything. Oh, uh, yeah, Ram of Ruined, yeah. Yeah, it looks all right. It's just, um, it confused the hell out of me. I was confused by it.
Oh. What is it? Oh, it's beast in there, that's alright. Where is he? Ah, got him. Oh, shit. Many flamethrowers. They, they've upped the damage of the uh, starves quite a lot. They don't leave your peril, so. Yeah. But the way this is built is. The more perils I have, the more damage I do. And so I, I try to ride around at like 60 to 70 percent perils at all time. But if I overreach and I'm about to explode, I can just hit F and dump all my perils out with Void Shriek. Boy Shriek's uh, basically the old ability, but it works very, very well. Um, I don't mind RTS, but I, I, like I say, that one just confused me. It was all a little bit rock, paper, scissors. I will, I will play RTS. Maybe I need to give it a mull. You focus on the boss man, I'll clear up the ads. That works really nicely now, man. Yep. Just basically shot him lots and lots. Yeah, man, the stubber builds are real nice. Yeah, it was all like pew pew pew. Rock, paper, when scissors the, does confuse rock... Arg. <laughs> no, I'm just saying when the rocks are like shaped like men with spears and paper is shaped like a flying man with a bow and it's the, the other side, man's rock is an orc with a shield and it's like... I then I get confused. If there were literal rocks walking across the thing and those literal scissors and bits of paper, I can I'll be all right with that. If the, yeah, the, man. The models, the character models of that. It does, that sounds more like our speed. Hmm. Literal, actual rock paper <laughs> scissors. Um, I'm gonna go find myself. I'll try and do like a like a. A tanky build. 
Yeah, you can do. Do it like we're living in. Are tanks any good? Don't know, man. Probably not, to be honest, but you know, you can always try no. it. Okay, so you know, the I'm always fiery into, build works I'm well. Try things, by the way. What? Oh, no, I'm just thinking the fiery build works really well. I was always a fan of rock paper knife. <laughs> rock paper knife stabby. Uh, right, let's try. Let's try. Um, let's try a different load. You don't Perhaps. get the like, You don't have. Oh, you do get presets. Yeah, you can. You've got say. You can have saved buttons up the top, man. There's a little plus sign that you can save different builds with. And then you could just reset, and then yeah. yeah. And my number one is going to be like ogre with a gun. Number two might be melee ogre. I'll do melee. Yeah. Angry melee. Ferocious. So this is the void strike staff, which requires me to actually aim. So we'll see how we get along with that. And ahoy, anyone new to the live stream? If you've got any questions, please feel free to ask. We will answer as best we can. Well, unless it's on like medieval dancing or leatherworking, then we shall point you towards our associate Django. Well, we do like. And if you're based in Berlin, you know, feel free to turn up to Django's dance studio every Thursday. It's in a church. Yeah. To hit the churches. Django's Dance Studio. You won't find any better or more medieval. You will dance. So for the next mission, I'm going to be rolling out with the uh, Equinox Void Strike for Star. Ink going pew pew pew. That's generally my plan. And again, we're using a pretty safe build with Brain Burst, Warp Siphon, and Venting Shriek, and mostly geared towards crit. Dancing will be mandatory, and we will be asking the questions. Right, and let me just find. I'm gonna stick with. I think the, I scared everyone um, off, I'm to gonna... be honest. <laughs> what are you gonna stick with? I'm gonna go grenade launcher, gauntlet, and the shovel's very good. It's been upgraded Double. a bit. Shoveling time. Okay, shoveling time. Shall we do a slightly more difficult mission? Yeah, man, I'm up for that. Shall we raid? Ah, oh, let's, let's raid the consignment yard. Oh, we got conditions there. Oh, you did. Dagger and a little upside down, a little alpha symbol. Uh, high intensity shot gauntlet. Oh, the high intensity shot gauntlet. Crack grenade, crack grenade. Mr. Shouty. Okay. So we've got a commissar, a gunner, a melee, and me. And uh, to everyone's glory, everyone's surprised they released the Krieg outfits and everyone's been buying them. 
If you notice, one of our teammates is dressed up like a Krieg. The, nope. Didn't they already have the Krieg outfits before? No, no, that was the Steel Legion one. Oh, yeah. Everyone likes Krieg, don't they? Yeah, and there's even a Krieg outfit for the Ogryn, man. Is there now? There is. Do, do Krieg, are Ogryn in the Krieg? Krieg are in yeah, the there, there are Ogryn in the Krieg, man. Are they? Yeah. Not a huge amount, but there are Ogryn in the Krieg. Yeah, why hasn't he got his horse with him? He's weird. Oh, this guy's gone full Krieg, man. He's using a uh, Hellbore. It's glorious. Glory, glory, what a hell of a way to die for the Emperor. Oh no, bad start. My first act is that Amelia Algrim is to fall off. He's coming, but there is a lot of them. There's a little tiny hole there. Too long. Like... We'll never forget you, Ug. No. I remember the bleeding gun works now. <laughs> Ow. Oh. oh man, they're just going straight for you. I'm sorry. <laughs> Just everything went for you. Yeah. I haven't got any taunts or anything. No, they just they just saw you went. Although, I I got to try out the void uh, strike staff to great success. Yeah. I like it. Very effective. And it doesn't get blocked by um, friendlies. Good. Hit a reaper in the head of it. Oh! Don't like being a melee. <laughs> <laughs> Grey Psyker. <laughs> oh man, I'm really enjoying the Void Strike stuff. It's silly. You ain't ready in nothing, boy. Okay, I think I found my new favorite build. Oh. No, Uggery. No. 
What did I ever do to deserve this? Went melee. Yeah. Okay. So that was an error on my behalf. Error. I'm going to go back to being... Look, you can't really be a melee ogre. You can. I just, I just think you haven't gotten used to the new changes. What are the new changes? Lots of things. Oh, it's all right. I will sit uh, and soothe my aching neck with cake. I haven't got any cake. Actually, I've got a scone. You could soothe your pains of a scone. I already want a scone though. Has it gone that far that not even a scone would help? It's not really scone time of day, is it really? Not really. Scone's like mid morning. <sighs> I mean, I've got to say, kids game anyway. <laughs> oh yeah, obligatory. It's a. It's just a kids game. I've unwittingly built the best build in the world. All right, let's go save Ugg. Yeah, my face. I am a generous guard, but also a wrathful guard. Oh, I'll save you, Oak. There is a help station over here. Oh, God. Like a big pile of dogs behind us. Oof. That was scary. really enjoying this and I feel bad that you're having a horrific time <laughs> oh, it's fine but do you think the uh, talent trees have made a big impact on the game I think the talent trees have made a big impact on the drain, on the drain? Um, Positive they, impact, or? impact on my ability to talk. Um, yeah, I think they're good, man. And I think it's very. Um, I mean, obviously, it'd be good to know a bit more about them because I'm yeah. useless. But you know, 
I should really watch some sort of like YouTube video or something. Yeah, man, if only somebody spent the last two days not sleeping and making continuous guides. Yeah. You know any recommendations to channels I should go for for a build? Because. Man, there's this party theme channel that doesn't really do much party stuff. No. So they're just tangentially themed towards pirates, but they've got some good guides. Oh my god, it's over. I can't stand that Zug guy. He oh, is it because at a fundamental level? Is it because he keeps starting his videos with uh, Ratchet Bears? Does he? No. Because he's not weird. Maybe you should. Maybe I should. I mean, he should. <laughs> I'm basically just an artillery piece. Error. Error. I like this, they're all just aiming for you, so I'm just shooting at you. There's an awful lot of them. Yeah, it, there's um, an awful lot of them. Oh man, I honestly do think you should get yourself the Krieg outfit though if you're Ogryn. No. I'll save you. Outrageous. I do find it hilarious, man. The veteran does have a Kruber build now. You can make shouty Kruber. So Christmas is a lot of them. Why won't you die? Very rude zombies. What all my two favourite things for us? Extreme and sudden violence and, and large spout, sparkly balls. Chaos spawn. I'll grab that. Oh, I'm off, off picked up. I'll drop it when you guys need it. Oh! Testicles! Whoa! Yeah, they are two of my favourite things. Shoot Ugg. Shoot Ugg. In a friendly way. Uh, good old venting shriek. Oh, sweet. 
Jab, dibbly, jib, jab. Wait, do you want to go back to being arranged? Yeah. Got that goddamn sniper. Be gone, rotten fiends. You stop backing away, man. I'll cover you. Get back here, right. Ah, oh, right in the kisser. I think what would cheer you up uh, is dressing your ogre up like a Krieg soldier and using a big two-handed gun. Mm, I'm, sure it would. I'm like, you know, Spartan in essence. Yeah, I know you need ammo. I'm going to drop it in here. Oh. oh my god, that's like a, a stand-up ability. Yeah, that's, that's what I mean when I said it's got a crew ability, man. the Kruber shout on your feet mates <laughs> oh, my face my beautiful face Am I still beautiful? Probably want to heal up now. I'm going to. I've got little legs. No, it can't, Frost. Don't give him any free will. Yeah, I can't want. Yeah. I want to look cool. You can't look cool. 
Very common food. Zombies go boom. That was a good shot at the sniper. Who got him? Uh, one of the veterans. Amusingly dangerous. Oh, here comes the book step. It's big like a tree. Get out of here. Did you have fun, Oak? Yeah, I had so much fun. <laughs> Would you like to go back to be in range? Yes, yeah, so we just <laughs> went back to being in range. If I'm totally in love with like the. Um, Ogren stuff, then I may consider it. I don't oh, know. Oh, you meant to have a look at it. Yeah, yeah, but I'll have a squiz. I'll have a look. Have a look, see, see what it's like. But yeah. But I will be melee. Do you mean ranged? No. Ranged. Oh, I've just been DC'd from the server. 100?
Oh, I'll swap to mine and I'll see what I've got. It's actually my worst performing video is the Ogrim Guide. There's no one wants one. Ogrim. There we go. Right. La Talents. What have I gone for? So, first point. You go down the middle to heavyweight. Yeah. And then you're going right for reload and ready. And then steady grip. Then the toughness boost. I didn't want, to re I didn't want for um, steady grip. You don't like steady grip? No, I didn't think it was that interesting. Okay, grab linchpin then and go to the toughness boost. Yeah, yeah, I went linchpin and then toughness boost and I went frag bomb. Frag bomb and then soften, soften them, up. them up. And then and toughness then boost to the right. I've gone for both of those toughness boost to the right and the toughness damage reduction to the left. I went for the point blank barrage. Yep. And for that, I've gone straight down the middle with bullet bravado and hail of fire. I went for the light him up. For burning. Doesn't do very much damage, man. Right, that's... And Rend just basically gives you a flat 30% increased damage, as that's what Rend does now. Oh, okay. Oh, I like fire, though. Fire is fun. It is fun, but it it doesn't do much. And then reload boost, and then you're taking both, both pacemaker and ammo stash. Yeah. And obviously range damage boost and then coward culling. I didn't go for coward culling. I flipped all the way back through the middle one and then I went hard knocks and stay close. And then went to toughness boost. So I figured like, you know, because you're more coherency because you're, this is a ranged ogring. So I was thinking if you go for stay close, so you go all the way up to the range damage boost. Yeah. Yeah, and then you and then you go for like the the tanky option. Honestly, man, I wouldn't. Why not? Because you don't need it, and hard knocks. You're not going to be switching to your melee weapon that often. Coward Cullen gives you a twenty percent damage against suppressed enemies for you and your allies in coherency. It's a group wide twenty percent damage buff. You can, man, if you want to go for it, go for it. It's just, that's my reasoning that I, why I wouldn't. Hold on. Oh, you can only have one of those. Yep. Yeah. And then from there, I'd grab the toughness damage reduction oh, and the... Gone wrong. Okay. Hold on, everything's going wrong for me, boy. Oh, there we go. Alright. Here we go. Three. How currently? Yep, the damage, duff, damage reduction underneath it. And then, but you also want to grab the toughness boost to the left and get stuck in. So that you become immune to stuns and suppression while you use your uh, ability. So that if you get charged or whatever, you just carry on shooting. All right. And then just, yeah, everything down to the bottom of the burst limiter override. Uh, yeah, but in this build, there are actually nodes that increase your ammo supply. But heavyweight at the start is one of the most important ones to take because it gives you a flat damage bonus against bulwarks, crushers, plague ogrins, and reapers, and a flat thirty percent damage reduction from them. Nice. Okay, I'm going to go for the. Well, I'm going to be fighting with my close combat shotgun. So yeah, it, the shotgun still works, man. 
change operative. I'm going back to my psychic. Let's have a look at the. Let's have a look at the. Um... Let's have a look at this pre kit for the ogre there and see what it looks like. Man, I don't think that looks like you. Fair enough. I'm still not convinced by any of the. <laughs> I've still not found anything. I've not found anything. I'd be like, oh, I've got to have that. Not ug. Um, when I'm stacked up like this, my shotgun's got like 41 shots in it, which is got them good. Quite a few bullets. You know, like, I don't know, what is it? In the Emperor's name, this unit bids you greetings. Um. So you can re bless two things now. Yep. So you can even be and two blessings, because I suck. How do you steal blessings out of things? Uh, you go up to the weapon you, you want. Actually... Yeah. You need to actually have a weapon to destroy, don't you? That's got yep. relevant stats. Yeah, you have to have a That's sacrificial weapon. If they've got any kickbacks in here. Oh. oh no, they haven't. That's really useful. Well, it's going to refresh in a minute, man. Do you want to um, go for a quick drink and then we shall continue with our exciting okay. try of these builds? Do you want to press the button? Um, I'm going to push the button. Sorry, right. people. Back in two minutes. <laughs> I think we did.
I hope you've all signed up for your um, Pelotons and your uh, Grammarlies now. And your blue circles. Your uh, mind control blue circles. You probably won't remember much after the blue circle spun. Don't worry, everything's working exactly as we planned it. It's Google. Google's sucking your mind. Sucking on your mind. Is that back here? Maybe not. But anyway, it's lovely, uh, lovely to have all the people. See, I see, I see new numbers here. It's lovely to have you. If you've got any questions about this game or anything related to the Warhammer world, we answer questions on that. We do all sorts of things like that. We also paint models on the channel on uh, Sundays. We usually paint models tonight, but because it's a special new edition, we are now playing this game on a Thursday, just for the time being, I think. Normally, um, normally Zug is painting on Thursdays, and I'm not painting on Thursdays. I, I I generally don't know what happens when you push the button. It says insert an advert. I don't know what that means. Maybe it, it maybe it inserts an advert when you're playing it back. I don't know. <laughs> Literally no idea. Again, don't know how any of this works. I still feel bad about doing adverts. Not exactly. There you go, he's summoned by, you can hear him coughing, coughing along. <laughs> but yeah, but um, we'll be about on Sunday actually painting some models. I'm slowly building, I'm slowly building um, skeletons. I've done absolutely no work on some skeletons. Um, and, and I got so frustrated with building death rattle skeletons that I went and bought some zombies which are probably just as bad to build and I also bought a necromancer because it's a single model and I figured that I could handle building a single necromancer model yep I'm back. I wanted something to paint because I've got like, literally nothing to paint at the moment all right yeah you're back uh I'm ready to roll hang on, I'm just changing yeah, the title so... yeah so um I bought a necromancer. Did I tell you I bought a necromancer? You did tell me you bought the necromancer. Oh, I bought a necromancer and I've painted it. Or I've started. I, I, I um. What do you do? Primed him. That's the word. Cool. Already, I primed him just before the stream. Actually, in the two minutes before the live stream, I gave a quick whack of primer on him. So it'd be ready for me to. Oh, that's what you're doing. Tomorrow. Yeah, I was having a bath as well. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I parried the model. Oh, well, that's an old school zealot looking yep. lady there. But yeah, absolutely. Uh, right, let's go and do this mission, shall we? Oh. Yep, Ugg um, Ug does like no. to paint in the bath. <laughs> You've got a little, um, you know those things they use for swimming? Those little like foam boards so you don't drown. You have one of those floating in the bath of your paint pot. Flotation on. aid. Yeah. Water wings. No, not water wings. A flotation aid? Yeah. No, I've actually got a, a flotilla of rubber ducks. Ah, uh, yeah, it makes more sense. And I've built a little... A little sub raft and the rubber ducks carry it like a rubber duck based um, <laughs> uh, Halloquin <laughs> only the it's finest the for your miniatures only a, any of the finest rubber duck based Halloquins for the for the necromancers I'm a fan of this shotgun. Yeah, the shotgun's good. Because it's just brutal. Yeah, 
You need ammo, apparently. No. I forgot that. I was trying to work out what the eternal fire button was. Is that you grunting like a stuck pig? No, that was one of the, the zombies. Here comes the doggos. Well, this is a hunting ground one. I'm trying to loot things, people. Kisser. Oh, I missed him. Thank you. Yay, crafting the agents. Oh, it's a beast of Nurgle. Zombies! Damn you, zombies! Oh, and in about a week's time, man, we've got some Vermintide to play. Does that mean you're going to be playing Sienna? Yeah, or you can play Sienna. Or we can take turns. <laughs> It will be uh, the, for your for Django's pleasure watching you see it play Sienna. Yeah, I know. Where are them doggos coming from? I can hear doggos, I can't see the doggos though. Ah, oh, they're above us. They're in the trees. In the trees. Doggos. There 
How dare you? How are the dogs? I'm just generally blowing them up as they appear. Is there someone continuously shooting the gun as well somewhere? Don't know. I would not be surprised if some of the sound assets are a bit broken. Shall we bimble on? I bimbled ages ago. No, oh, fair enough. It's a grenade there, dude. Sure. Yeah, oh, I do. Find myself wondering what eyes have seen. Many souls become lost on the tides of the Amateur. Why do I keep getting a goddamn beeping in my headphones? Maybe it's in your head. No, it's every now and again. It's it's a, just a slight beep, like a telephone, an old like nineties telephone beep. Maybe you're in the nineties. I don't know. Maybe I'm just having a stroke. Maybe you are a, maybe you are a telephone. There's a flying. Oh, never seen that. Oh, Frost heard a hard beep as well. Okay, so it, it is happening. So I'm not going to say insane. Thank you. And Django heard it as well. There you go. Yeah, like a touch tone. Damn you, gunners. Desist with your gunning. Yeah, we made it. That was nice of him. He wants everyone to heal. It's good. 
Doggos. I'm really enjoying this stuff. It is fun. I like the void staff, it is warm. <clears throat> right. What bad things do we have around here? Mutant in my face. Everyone else is red off. Very rude, he dodged. Oh yeah, I absolutely love not having to to talk about of ammo or grenades. I'm completely self sufficient. All I need to be happy is a fancy hat and a big staff. I do like um I do like a good hat. Sorry. Right. I did like the ice shards, they were fun. You've done an ice shard build yet, though? Yeah, yeah, man. A couple of my builds use the ice shards. But Brain Burst still kind of wins out just for the fact that the. Uh, Warp Siphon buffs you get just increase your damage in a flat manner. And also, Brain Burst can auto-trigger every 15 seconds. So you literally don't have to do anything to trigger it. So it's lots of damage for being incredibly lazy. Which I'm a big fan of. Yeah, man. This is quite... Right. Right up my alley, really, then. I mean, sounds more like my sort of thing. Like, literally zero effort for damage. Yeah. I mean, I think you would enjoy these Psycho builds. 
Again, if only I knew there was someone to get a decent second one. I know, man. I definitely Diana was here. What are you holding on to a grimoire, eh? Yeah, one of them picked it up. I wonder I'm feeling ill. Feeling a bit sick. Yeah. Uh, no, it doesn't increase warp perils at all. So the warp siphon is just, as you can see at the bottom of my screen, I've got six at the moment. That is a stacking de um, a stacking buff for your overall sort of damage. It does other things as well, but I'm mostly using it just for the damage boost. But it does make your active brain bursts uh, more painful. There's a sniper just lurking around out there. That's rude. Uh, I'll block this around here. Bend it a little bit. He's dead, Jim. Good. There's my lovely hat. Oh, yeah, man. Looks like you're doing the worst. Um, it's like I'm the there. worst witch hunter captain of the world. I'll, I'll have you know. <laughs> That's the exact reason I got it. I it's know. like, hmm, I could look like Saltfire. You could in turn be the worst witch hunter captain of the world. Yep. And for any new v viewers in the channel, if you are enjoying the content or if you liked any of the stuff we've done, if you'd like, subscribe, hit the little bell for notifications. It really does help us out. And also, if you've got any questions about nice. builds or dark tides, please just shout and we will do the best we can to help. The worst psycho captain. Yep. Player. The worst witch oh. hunter witch in the world. That's how bad I am. I'm a witch hunter. That's a witch. Yeah, I can't I even find know. myself. I disconnected it again. <laughs> What's wrong with you? Don't At know, least man. it's the... not completely destroying your game anymore. Yeah. It's slightly different. You know what? While you're busy doing that, I may change my operative. Operative. I do something so, so different. So different. It's scappy, a change mm -hmm. operative. Oh yeah, that's it. How original. Which octave would you be changing to? I was going to go for the veteran. Oh, fair enough. Yeah, let's give it a go. See how bad I can be with doing the veterinary. Veterinary. Makes you sound like I'm going to be operating on some sort of animal any minute now. Some livestock. I'm doing some, vet some veterinary surgery. So let's see what, um, I'll show you what Warp Siphon actually does. So, Warp Siphon, killing an elite or special enemy grants you a warp charge for 25 seconds, stack it to four. Your next combat ability spends all available warp charges to reach the cooldown of that combat ability by 7.5% per warp charge. So the combat ability would be Venting Shriek. So the more I have of that, the quicker that comes up. But I also get... Uh, minus six percent peril generations while with each warp charge uh, increase all base damage by four percent for each warp charge and whenever you are an ally in coherency kills an enemy you have a four percent chance to gain a warp charge and warp battery i can have up to six so four eight twelve sixteen twenty twenty percent base damage 
no, 24% base damage because it's 6. And I spend them to make that cool down faster. And I want that cooling down faster because that's how I vent my perils. So that I can just continuously shoot. And then I've got brain burst. Oh, and I think something bent. all your attacks have a 10% chance to uh, on hit to brain rupture the target. This cannot occur while you're at critical perils, which is 99 or above and has a cooldown of 15 seconds. So every 15 seconds, one of my hits will trigger brain burst. You know, they've changed it to brain rupture. the constantly regenerating grenades option anymore uh yeah somewhere yeah there's some real nice synergy in these builds do you want me to jump on the um veteran and give you a build oh go on then oh, i don't have to man if you want to just copy sell something together no no come on. No, on i don't mind oh you pick something rubbish anyway so uh, do you want the old style build or do you want the the shouty Kruber build? Oh, probably old style build. That's good because I haven't actually made a shouty Kruber build yet. It looks like straight down the middle is the option. Pretty much. Right. Let's have a look at the old veteran. So. You want to be heading to the left with long shot. Yeah. Uh, you want to be picking up volley adept. Then shredder frag grenade. Yeah. Then the range damage boost. Then we're heading to the middle for the health boost. Yeah. Then covering fire. In the middle. Yeah. Fire team as your aura. Yeah. Uh, you want all three of these ones, so crit chance boost, toughness boost, and reload boost. Great. Grenades. Then you want kill zone and opening salvo. Yeah. Then execution stance and all of its uh, tertiary abilities. And then range damage yeah. boost underneath it and the stamina boost in the middle. And I'll tell you why we want the stamina boost in the middle. Because we want the two mm -hmm. things underneath it. The stamina is garbage, but we want tactical awareness and bring it down. Okay. So you do 25% extra damage to Ogrins and Monstrosities. Yeah, I are. And Tactical Awareness, combat abilities cooldown reduced by 6 seconds on special enemy kill, which means you can basically keep yourself in Executioner Stance permanently. Alright, from there we're going back over to the left side, getting the range damage boost, the reload boost, and exhilarating takedown. Yeah. And then we're taking toughness damage reduction. Mm. Precise strikes. Mm. Uh, are you using a las gun? Or are you using an auto gun? Yeah. Las gun. Uh, then you'll want to take a shock trooper as well. I guess it's like all the way down. Oh, no. And, and then... Toughness boost, determined, toughness damage reduction, always prepared. Toughness boost and marksman. You may have to dump a point out of bring it down though because you are taking shock trooper. I don't tend to use las weapons. I usually go for the auto guns, so I take bring I it down. I don't want like. I don't want to go all the way to marksman then. 
Yeah. You're the way to Marksman. Hmm. I want the replenish one grenade every 60 seconds ability. That'll be alright. Well, you can get rid of tactical awareness and bring it down if you want, but it'll be a big fucking damage drop. I'm fine. This'll yep. be fine. Right, yeah. Bear in mind, I can't hit a butt side of a barn anyway, so it's a problem for me. Fair. Remember, I'm very good at um, not hitting things. That is true. Here's my secret skill of being... That's why I don't play the marksman very often. Oh, due yeah. to my lack of marksmanship. <laughs> yeah, um, that would do it, man. Yeah. Oh, somebody's asked me what attack combo I use for the Eviscerator. Uh, that was a Look comment on one of the that. videos. On one of the videos. Luckily, I was changing over to the Zealot anyway. It's all rubbish in here. Rubbish. Right. Let's, uh, let's do some... Stuff. Yeah, man. This might have to be my personal last one, man. Because I. Ah, uh, you suck. It. You can always hang around, can't you? I will do. Come on. I need to get in a bed fairly soon because I'm like old is the word. Old. Fair enough. I'll be tucked into bed into my ugg pit. Oh, we can't let it down, man. So I was feeling his oats. No, it's not. It's just how I'm sitting. Have you got a chain axe build? No. <clears throat> because his chain axe is so good. I don't know the best way to describe how to play it. Turn it on and swing it. Oh dear. That's a heavy start. What? There we go. Generally, my attack pattern is heavy attack and block push if you have to. Heavy attack is your friend with the eviscerator.
A bombardier. Don't know. Well, everyone's kind of Oh man, it looks got nuked upstairs. No, it's a, it's a 12, 12 of the clock at night, so half, half 12, no, half 11. They're not too late, but... This isn't a normal stream night for you. No, it makes it sound like I, like, like I can't stream on a certain night. You can't, you get too sleepy. Oh yeah, that's that's why I normally sleep on certain nights because I yeah normally sleep. Oh my god, those bombers, man. Those bombers just like one hitting me. Do they one hit you normally? Uh, no? Sorry, I'm a bit. What, the grenades? Yeah. Yeah, man, those grenades fucking really hurt. And also, it doesn't help there's like a million gunners up here as well. Jesus Christ. There's a Medicaid station downstairs if you want to go grab it. There's one heal left in it. Yeah. I'm going to go and help out our friend the but... No, I'll go do that one. now with the buffs that they've given to the skill tree. Well, I've specifically built this so that the flamer is good with it.
Oh, lot of them. Incoming grenade. It's a hambush. So this is why I put an insane amount of movement speed into this build. Because sometimes when you need to push up, you just need to keep moving until everything's dead. Otherwise you will die. Scum. They're so scummy. I'm standing on street corners drinking their white lightning. It's a very good station slow. Right, no care. Uh, you sometimes can, but you've got to get the angle really, really fucking right. box so if you want to grab it too. Oh. 
bottoms. Yeah, the, the Thunder Hammer just... It's still not there. Oh my god, so many things. I'm not very good at the uh, chart for the irony. Let's grab a bit of healing. We have a little bit of ammo. It's burned some things.
They were very good at killing monsters. Time to swing again. It just feels like the eviscerator flows so much better than it used to. I tried the eviscerator. And it's it's real nippy now. Lovely. Uh, yeah, I think they unlocked the th three limit cap. So instead of, so what they did to the cleave before was you could hit three targets, but everything over that was basically you did no damage. So they locked the cleave. And now it's unlocked, but not exponential damage. It's like slight, there's a slight drop off the damage the more you cleave, basically. So it's a more reasonable uh, system instead of just going, no, cleave is bad. Fair enough. No cleaving fun for you. No. We give you a million monsters to fight. Why would you want to cleave? You fight them one at a time. Yeah, pretty much. That you've done so for the evening. Yeah, man, I do need to uh, crash. It's at late o'clock for me. Okay. Have to go and be a productive member of society, apparently, do I? Yes, yeah, so do I. I have to get up stupid early. But I'm just pretending it's not happening. Fair enough. Yeah. 
Well, that's a good way of dealing with your issues. Just yeah, deny them. Man. They're actually happening. That's beautiful. Yep. Okay, everyone. Thanks a lot. Um, I leave you Zug and uh, take it easy, man. Thanks for watching, everyone. And uh, I'll see you uh, probably see you tomorrow. Oh, I got like disconnected again. Yeah, catch you later, dude. Cheers for coming. Yep. Yep. No worries, man. No. Uh, take it easy, everyone. Uh, trying to think how I go. I don't. I don't kill. You just leave. You just don't, turn off Discord and run leave, away. Don't, I just, I just don't, don't end the stream. And walk to go to bed. Yeah. Okay. Right. See you later, dudes. See ya. There we go. Back in the game. See, did I get any of my contracts fulfilled? No. Well, we'll carry on trying to fulfill them. I do spoil you. Uh, what should we do next? Do the silo cluster. Mm -hmm. I've done that one for a couple of hours. Just changing my vape battery. Sorry, folks. Give me a second. So there was going to be painting tonight, but with everything that's going on with Dark Tide, it was kind of like, yeah, should really get on this a bit more. And do the things. Oh, and uh, yesterday's um, Rift Breaker video will be re-recorded with commentary because uh, the sound broke on it again and it annoyed the hell out of me. So that should be up tomorrow. But I do have to basically re-record the entire bloody thing. Not with goo. I'm a ghoul man, you'll see. Oh yeah, with uh, everything that's going on this week, it was like, I've kind of got to do Dark Tide because massive new patch, possibly game changing. Oh dear, someone's role playing as a commissar. Oh, they will be painting next week because I need to paint some more Dark Angels. Making really good progress on them, and I don't want to slow down. Well, those bollocks just got beaten to death.
I just like how visceral the uh, Eviscerator is. It's satisfyingly gooey. That was a lot of explosions. Ow! What is shooting me? Oh, there's something up there. Bloody gunners. Jesus Christ, gunners are dangerous. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh my god, how many gunners are there? Apart from just all of them. Not quite sure how I missed that. Give old Flaby a reload. Oh, shit. So many gunners. I don't like them. Oh, Jesus, I didn't see that coming. Lovely, lovely health station.
Uh, they're just raining from the ceiling. There's so many of them. behind us somewhere. Sure, nothing, bitch. Oh, you absolute bastard. Chilled lift. Can't say I understand. I suppose I don't have to. For a toman! For the Emperor! For the throne! We fight for the innocent! Where's the fragging space marines? This is a job for them, not us. Joint. I almost didn't see that. Oh, I just got myself ruined doing that. Where's that goddamn sniper? I, I am healing, because I want to. No, don't, don't sneak around it that way. Please don't. Oh dear, I didn't like that. Oh, you absolute fucker, I dodged. Oh, pricks. Absolute pricks.
Oh my god, why is no one fucking covering me or generally being useful? They were just pissed off into the other room. This is why, why I like playing with Ugg and PT, because they actually play as a team and they don't just piss off. Oh, it's a horde behind us. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna fuck off. It's not like Vermintide where they actually had character names. These are all just random people. You are random prisoner number whatever with your own given name. This lovely Kruber though. And his big trusty beard. Nobody should probably shoot that, but not my problem. My hits just seem to go through him there. That was weird. This guy's going to give me a fucking ulcer in a minute. God oh, damn it. Just broke that one.
Okay, I will do everything. Okay. Definitely a health kit around here somewhere. I just saw one. Oh, there it is. God damn it. Oh, God. Stop using those fucking smoke grenades as well, you absolute asshole. They are not helpful. Yeah, it's because they're just kind of fucking about, to be honest. Like, the psych is just ignoring that one. Even though they're on a timer and they will respawn. Is that bastard? Oh, there he is. Pretty sure I killed him. I saw an arm fly off. Where are they spawning from? Oh yeah, most bugs are just pretty, you know, pretty decent, pretty forgettable, but then some of them they're just like, oh my god, this is so painful. Every minute feels like a thousand years. But this, this one wasn't awful, it was just awkward. I don't often have really bad pug experiences in this game. Most of them, are, uh, most of the groups are pretty good. Like even if you fail at a mission, it usually fails pretty quick because something goes wrong. But missions like that, where it feels like you're working against a group the entire time, just ugh, they are stressful. Oh well, on to the next one. Can't rain all the time. I wonder, is it going to disconnect me again? Quite possibly.
Oh no, didn't disconnect me. The ambassador spoils me. Alright, let's see if I finish these bloody contracts yet. Oh, what now? Oh god, I've got more contracts to do still. Fine. And here is a is a Cree Gogrin. Uh, are we going to change anything? I don't think we are. Uh, let's go do this one. Lovely espionage mission. Uh, there are some mentions here and there, but there's no sort of, I, I can't find any, like, stories about Krieg Ogren. There's just sort of, like, little mentions. No, no, no worries for us. Ask what you want, man. Ogrens were pretty widespread throughout the Imperium, so... I assumed they did, and in one or two of the stories, there was just vague mentionings of like Ogren lifting up, uh, you know, artillery shells and stuff for people, and you know, doing the grunt work. But they're never really highlighted. Oh, the load times still aren't great. I do like the Krieg outfit they've brought into the game. It looks really nice. <laughs> I quite like that premise, Wandering. Not really, they were just kind of abhumans that they decided were not mutant enough to get rid of, but useful enough to keep around. So they just kind of let them stay. Did not see that sniper. Buggering hell. Off will he? Got sandwiched in between him and something stuck behind me. Yeah. They were tolerated. They were seen as 
just human-like enough to not um, instantly purge them. Probably just useful enough as well. Sand of an end. Damn it, people put knocking stuff back. Gonna press the button? Okay, cool. Oh, got all turned around. Yay, push the big button. Shit. Didn't realise that was a mauler. Oh shit. Did we hit that? I don't suppose you've a lip of liquor to share with it. What do you know? I was. It was more to me than a vocation. It was my purpose. I hope you didn't mean for mortal life to contain a holy servant such as I.
Wait, is that end? Oh, he's done that. Of huffing and puffing from that zombie. The holy fire. No night, Django. Cheers, coming, dude. Bob's having a bit of trouble. I've gotten very turned around. Oh my god, stop throwing up at me, you disgusting bastard. Nothing irritates me more in games than being slowed, and I don't know why. Or like getting knocked off your mount. Especially in World of Warcraft, it always used to really piss me off.
Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, Wandering. And I'll be I'll be riding about on some pointless goddamn task I didn't want to do anyway, and then I'll get knocked off by a bunch of bloody murlocs and just be like, sorry. Follow our lovely skull. Where are we going, Scully? This serves like mumble rap. Next. Bad sniper. Somebody with a long range gun, please kill that sniper. Thank you. Sketched out a bit Oh shit, you motherfucker. Right, you don't need the fucking medkit. Alright, I have a medkit then. Yeah, most, uh, they say the average citizenry will never see one in their lifetime. I 
mean, numbers are difficult to come by, but there's probably no more than... Say, add a push a million of them throughout the entire universe. If they're a chapter compliant or codex compliant chapter, there's only a thousand of them. Other chapters don't really give a shit, so there might be 10,000 of them, which would be a legion. But. What, there's 12 loyalist chapters and their successors, so yeah. Maybe. I would say no more than a million across their known galaxies. And maybe 50,000 uh, custodians. Between 50 to 100,000. They say there's only 10,000, but later books have basically said yeah there, there's, there's more so we team say between 10 and 75,000 custodians you could probably fit them all into a reasonably large football stadium was it I'm on live chat, so if I've missed anything, just let me know. Finish these goddamn contracts yet. Ugh. Need to kill some more dregs in melee. Right. Oh, everyone's being very, very friendly.
Sorry, I was just catching up with um, some of the comments. Right, so. Oh, I forgot what I need to bloody do now. Uh, do, 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 view contracts, dregs with melee. Dregs. The Roby ones, that's what it is. Scabs are the ex military, dregs are the cultist looking ones. Uh, I've just done that one, but it is high intensity, so uh, it could be fun. We'll do high intensity. Let's go already. Tertium's got a problem with its water supply. Chiefly that it's no good for drinking. The that is a problem with water supply. I hate it my water supply is no good for drinking. And hurrah for auto modding, indeed wandering. Oh shit. Chucked in deep in then. Oh Christ. Let breathe for a moment, Jesus. What's going on? I don't suppose even net of liquor to spare kindred. There's a trapper somewhere. And a bomber. I got off. I just want to look in this box. Jesus. Everyone's so rude. Uh, okay, cool. I can heal. Where's the bomber? There he is. Nothing I can do it. I haven't got a ranged weapon. I've got a range weapon I can hit him. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Set a barrel. I won't let us leave without a fight. That's not very nice. They seem to know what they do. Oh shit, sniper. Like the true hero I am, I'm gonna hide behind a box.
Oh, there's a lot of bombers around. At least you can more reliably deal with hounds now. Oh, we broke the trapper. It's like he's scatting for us. Give it a bop, bop, skip, skip, bop, bop. Sticky. Oh god, that's an awful lot of guys. Dead, my oh. That was fun. Oh, high intensity, yeah, that'd be why.
one of those. Ah, oh, this is really enjoyable. I do love a good frantic game. Oh shit, didn't see that. Everyone down? Yeah, everyone's down. Cool. them something to think about. I'm not sure if that sniper's still live though. Lovely crafting materials. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, the farting cling on a fall about him. I mean, I'm, I'm sure we have to go back through the live streams and find the farting cling on. Socks over there. Let's do this. We got it. Look for the 
Right, where's the next one? Oh, I seize it. Oh, I don't have any grenades. That'd be why I can't use them. Oh, fuck off, will you? just seem to miss like every swing for the last 20 there. Oh, shite. Oh, it's so frantic and hilarious. I love it. Are we going to win? Probably. Oh shit. amusing Oh, we got a braced auto gun. How lucky. 
Oh, I've been finished these goddamn contracts yet. I'd like to play something else for a while. Why does my space button not work anymore? Skip. Skip, skip, skip. Skip. Sad skipping noises. There we go. No. I just want to change character is all. I'd like to play my Psyker again. It's just I, I'm, I feel obliged to get all these contracts done. I want to do at least one more mission on my Psyker. As those are the builds that are giving me the most problems to try and work out at the moment. Right, let's go check. Hey, done. Check the limited acquisitions. Nothing particularly interesting. Oh, no, no, man, just changing character. I want to go play with my boomstick. It's just I was so close to getting those um, contracts done. I, I felt obliged to stay there until they were completed. Right. Let's see if there's anything good in the shop for the Psyker. Big old no is the answer. Alright, what do I need to see for my con- Oh, melee kills. Well, that's not going to happen, because, uh... Using melee. Okay, so we're still using the warp siphon trauma build. The uh, void strike, even so, not trauma. Yeah, let's go to the Enforcer Station. Initial insertion will be through the sewer system. Other instructions will be issued en route. Go explode some people. So this is where the misfit hide from the Imperium's injustice. Enemy designation Sigma Minoris 33 are more plentiful in this region. Watch out for their teeth. What's this? 
Oh, low intensity hunting grounds. Doggos. Silly bulwarks. You have no protection against my mind bullets. Getting many melee kills though, am I? They come. Ah, it's on base. Much for big piles of armor. I sometimes think the common soldier has an easier life than the average Look out, sniper. sniper! But then I remember that commissars exist. Oh, they do have very much to do. Like nobody likes the commissar, but you sure would help make them. Ah, you absolute bastard. Not. 
Fuck it. Use the last one. Might as well. Who is shooting at us? Oh, mine is really off tonight. Yeah, it does get staggered occasionally. Oh shit. The release on this uh, Void Star seems to be a bit weird. Sometimes when we actually release the orb, it doesn't shoot it, it just kind of glitches. Oh my god, stop bloody moving! Yeah, a bit like that. It's like the charge and release is something slightly wrong with it. It doesn't happen all the time. Definitely off tonight. Yep, 
Yeah, it's it it still needs a little bit of polishing. Betty Pack, you say? Oh, you left that. Good monster. There we go. Bit better there. I am trying to figure out if I can fit a sail into this build instead of rain burst. But rain burst is hilarious. I dodged. Yeah, that um, playground did seem to be absolutely stunlocked. Better. 
anything else coming? Nope. That's about it. lobbing balls at this group until they move. Oh. I might fill around with the uh, surge stuff build off this. I killed one in melee, that'll be added to my contract. Uh, because I'm incredibly impatient. And it's really difficult to see through Ogrins, so I try to get out front and just start throwing barrages of Mind bullets. And with the Void Strike stuff, um, you've got to aim. With the others, you can just sort of hide in the back and just randomly throw shit out. I need to be slightly more proactive with the Void Strike stuff. So with the perk chest staff and the surge staff, I can generally just spray and pray, but when I'm using the void strike I actually have to kind of pay a small amount of attention to where I'm throwing these things. Yeah. Yeah, three Ogrins and a veteran, you're not in for a good time. But I do look fabulous, which is one of the most important things. Come on, come on, let me leave. There we go.
Yeah, let's see if I can have a surge build I can fiddle with. Tavo, talents. So, so on. So that's that one. Okay, so we're going to destroy the shieldy build because I don't care about it. And we're going to go for something kind of like. This, I think. So I'm not going to take that because we don't care about the regenerating faster. We do want Mind in Motion because it's amazing. Kinetic Presence. At that. That. Do we want that? Uh, we do want Crit Chance, don't we? Uh, let's try a little bit of toughness. Okay, I've got a point left over. What do I want? Warp Rider. There we go. Warp Siphon. Venting Streak. A sail build. Do we have the right staff on? We do have the right staff on. Alright, let's give this a go. And let's just go and be very sad at how many goddamn things we need to kill for Cy Melek. I'm guessing it's going to be a lot. Yep. I would change these, but they're, they're so very close to being finished. I just see the hope of getting a group below the Zealots. That would do it. I can sit at the back and eat all the packed lunches. There we go. High intensity. Let's go, let's go. Look at the talent tree I was waiting. Try that out. Um, they're tricky. I've only ever done a full zealot squad or a full. Psycho squad and um, things do go a bit weird in certain situations no, the psycho squad you're basically just a group of glass cannons yeah I mean you'd have to um, go into it sort of each knowing what you're going to go for have slightly different talent loadout, but it can it, it work. I've got mind bullets. Get him, mind bullets. Yes, 
Yeah, I still think the Surge Staff is very, very usable. It does a lot of damage. And I just saved that poor trooper there. Has a little stun on it now. Don't worry, guys, I've got my mind bullets. Away from them. Is the Ranger. Ah, uh, they're on the move like Aslan. And hand me. Yeah, they're really good, and they just re they replenish really, really quickly. And hand me your ruffians. I mean, they're quite funny. Not exactly sure how effective they are, but they are hilarious. I'll save you, teammate. Stop it. Okay, that's really ineffective on the mutants. I might as well be throwing peas at him. Someone upset the demon host. Ooh. 
We're about to find out if it was me. I don't think it was me. Oh, that's a lot of gunners. Pretty sure it wasn't me that upset it. Though it might have been. But I'm pretty sure it wasn't. Well, is that with the shards, Frost, or with the staff? Oh, go, go, Trooper. I believe in you, Trooper. You can do it. Uh, shards, I think they bounce between three targets. I believe new trooper you're amazing go trooper you're so great go trooper you're so great <gasps> he's only fucking done it I was going to compliment him and then I got shot. I'll compliment him later. I mean, that was some impressive trooper playing there. Right, I'll stop fucking around with the, the shards. Oh shit, I got backed into a corner. No, oh, my hat. You'll make it wet. And hand me, you beast. I mean, whatever happens with this game, that, that guy is MVP. I feel kind of bad because I'm literally just arsing around because I'm really tired. Oh. Sure, I didn't see them. you piss off Are 
yeah, they, they gain much less health. Yeah, much less health eating someone in this. I would still say Vermintide is a lot hard on this. Yeah, I mean, a sail it is funny, but I think I'd still prefer having Brain Burst. I mean, I'm not sure to be honest, man. Brain burst just seems far more useful because it, you it it triggers while you're doing other stuff. It's not like I have to make a poignant decision to go, right, right, I need to brain burst right now. It's pretty much popping off every 15 seconds. And it's pretty decent at prioritizing hard targets as well. have the horde control to be able to Yeah, the lightning ability, um, it hits way more people, but it does piss all damage. But it does stun lock everything, which is useful. But how useful that is compared to a sail or brain burst, 
I would say not massively. I think Surge needs to be able to bounce more. This is quite upsetting that you can get overwhelmed in a horde situation this easily. Where the fuck is it? overly impressed with it I mean it's cool and it's got its uses but I'm more it's like a go zap So it's quite weird being this overwhelmed on a Psyker. I miss my Rift Haven star. assist so if you left click you just chuck one out if you right click and hold it kind of grabs onto whatever target you kind of get your cursor near Wrecking up those melee kills. Must be calm. Yeah, they home and they bounce between targets if you charge them long enough. We're being mauled again by something. Yes, we are. But be so careful that my lightning or my guards don't bounce down and touch that goddamn demon host. I don't like being this close. Oh shit. I need to be so careful. Oh, shooting hell. Right, I need to actually pay attention as well. Ugh. I'm, I'm in some sort of wall void. Fine. Oh, 
Wait, I'm trying to help. Yeah, I was expecting it to suddenly go horribly wrong then, so I was just kind of holding my breath. Yeah, the gun keep the uh, staff keeps sketching out as well. Like occasionally, it just won't fire. I'm not convinced, to be honest. I'm not wildly convinced by it, so it's it's a lot better than uh, Smite, but is it comparatively better than Brain Burst? I just feel th this entire build is veering away from what the sniper, sh the sniper, the psyker should be, which is your ability to horde clear, but also 
do very, very precise damage to uh, hard targets. Can't see where the bloody thing is, though. Maybe I'm missing something with a sail. Oh yeah, they're very pretty and occasionally very, very, very useful. It's like um, Gondu's whistle arrow from Gods of the Galaxy. Yeah, it's nice you can just vaguely throw them in something's direction and it dies, but still. Still, uh, Castellius, fucking player of the game there. That was impressive. Caselius, we salute you. I leave yet? I'm really bored of looking at this screen. Thank you. God.
See what crappy staff they gave me. Is it going to be crap? I bet it's going to be crap. It's pretty crap. Let's uh, let's fiddle with these talent skins. What was this one? Well, that's just your bog standard one. Let's try something else. Let's give, let's give the shield another try. Uh, get that. Get that. Have that. Do you want that? Do you want that? No, we definitely want the range damage. Bit of stun. Lovely bit of stun. I do have one more point. What would I like? Let's grab that. Yeah, we'll try this out. We'll have a shieldy build. Should we go see how disappointed we are with how many uh, melee kills we got on that? So Sire Melkit will make us do these contracts forever. Forever oh, you will be doing these. I am very tempted. I, I quite like the psycho one. Right, fuck it. All right, people keep saying this is it. The sale is really, really good. So we will try it. We'll keep trying it. We've got unyielding. Unyielding is not great, but mm, kind of all we've got to work with at the moment. I could try and roll a new one. Yes. But that is a massive pain in the arse having to roll a new one. Fuck it, we'll stick with what we got. Yeah, we'll do a high intensity. They're more amusing than the low intensity ones. Don't worry, next week, Thursdays, we'll be back to painting. It's mostly which just it's release week for Dark Tide, so, you know, I'm getting all the Dark Tide in. Just sitting there looking at my Dark Angels on my desk, it's like they need painting. It is finished painting us. We have no eyes. We have no eyes to see. The Dark Angels, you don't need eyes to see where you're going.
Some may say I've been streaming for too long and I'm losing the plot. To them I say poppycock, I'm fine. We're still using our mind bullets. Just as the Emperor intended. Gotta remember, I can't vent my perils though. Oh, it stuns the bombers. That's useful to know. I'm ignoring them and I'm just carrying on killing. <laughs> Jokes on you. I'm a fucking wizard. Okay, I quite like this. Uh, you can make it a bubble, or you can make it a little shield. I'm a golden guard. Yeah, doesn't help if they're shooting you from behind, though. There is he. Huh. Yeah, I'm actually... This is just something I've been toying with in the back of my mind. I didn't think it would work, but it's actually working really fucking well. Yeah. Well, 
Oh, you left that. Oh, kind of wrecked the sniper pretty well. Where's that bomber? Do as I tell you, mind bullets. Maybe it's because I can't see him. I know you're here, bomber. Yeah, I'm quite interested to see what it does with bosses. Sit behind my shield. Yeah, they they do confuse themselves in crowds. Bad dog. Okay, doesn't seem to stop monstrosities. Oh shit. Oh, bugger, I blocked myself in a corner. Piss off, will you? I, man, I was I was panicking too much. Didn't actually see if it did stop it or not. Bonjour. Out. 
No. Oh shit. Is there another goddamn monster? That's definitely monster music. I mean, I do feel like this build's working, kind of. I mean, it is hilarious doing that to mutants and dogs. And please don't anyone clip that and take it out of context. God damn it, wandering. I will not say it again. I grant you that. Put it on the whole work, Stella. Oh. 
I said it is hilarious doing that to dogs and mutants. It when demons rotate bridges. Like the most passive aggressive attack in the world. Stop shooting me. Where the fuck is everyone?
No, don't say it for us. Don't say that. Mind bullets at them for a while. Oh, damn it. Just try to have some goddamn fun. I don't know what any of these people are doing apart from not very much. And that goddamn dog got through my shield. Holy shenanigans. No, for us, no, it won't be nerfed, it'll be fun, fun forever. Right, sadly, I am going to have to crash as it is, like, what, three in the morning. So I hope you've all enjoyed, and for people watching this on the VOD, thank you very much for watching this long. If you have enjoyed, please like, subscribe, hit the little bell for notification, it really does help us out. Wandering Frost, as always, guys, it has been a pleasure. And uh, I'll fucking know, I'll see you uh, tomorrow for more things. I'm going to go curl up in a ball now. So... Enjoy the rest of your evening. I shall see you all later. Farewell.